St. Nick's here with a little update on what's been going on. Uh, first off, we just wanted to say thank you to everybody who's donated to our GoFundMe page and who's come into the store and shown their support um, by buying products in our store and people who have bought products online. So we just thank you so much for all of that. Um, we love you for that and just all the sympathy. Um, we just grateful, so grateful. Um, moving on, we looked at a spot in Berthoud, Colorado this morning. Um, it's a lot smaller and cheaper than our spot that we have on Main Street here in Longmont um, right now. So uh, if that all goes through, we will be in that spot within a month um, of us closing. So we are closing on February 19th. That'll be our last day in the shop. Um, and we are doing our name your price sale all the way until then. Um, so that's going on online and in store as well. So we spoke to an attorney today as well. Um, finally found one that was uh, willing to talk to us about uh, the situation and what we can do going forward. So she had offered to write up a demand letter um, and try to get some reimbursement from him. Um, and that's what we can do on that side. As far as the investigation goes and any charges, the only thing we've heard so far um, is that they're working on trying to subpoena his bank records to see if he ever had the money um, that he promised us. So that's where that's at right now. That's all we've heard. Um, we did hear from <laughs> Fox News, uh, the I guess they're out of New York. Um, we heard from the Fox and Friends. Um, that is part of the Fox News. They want to do an interview with us on this whole thing, which is pretty crazy. Uh, we thought Denver 7 was crazy, and this is even crazier. So um, we, I spoke to them today. I spoke to one of the ladies today. Um, probably be doing an interview within the week, uh, so keep an eye out for that. So if anybody doesn't know what's going on or wants to know the full story, go to the Times Call website and just type in Toy Store and we'll be the first one to pop up there. That is the best story out there. It gives lots of details. Uh, the lady interviewed a ton of people that are, that are involved. So that's uh, a great place to go if you want some answers or are a little confused as to what's going on here. So um, that's pretty much it. We'll keep keep going with updates as we get updates on our space that we're moving to um, and the investigation as we get more details on that and I'll be able to give a definite date on when we are doing the Fox News, the Fox and Friends um, interview. I don't have a date right now but it'll be within the week so keep a lookout for that but other than that that's it guys thank you so much for watching and uh, we'll see you guys on the next video.